What's going on guys, T-Mart here, and welcome back to another episode of Super Koopa Sunday! Woo! Yay! New spins for Sundays! How exciting! What's up Koop? How are you doing? It's another beautiful week, and we are back for the people. Anyway guys, today we're going to be focusing on the unsung hero of Super Cooper Sunday. He's uh, not quite the center of attention, he's a little bit more behind the scenes, but he's just as important. Today is going to be all about Coda. So Coda's a little bit different. I mean, he lays on the floor super weird. As you guys can see, unfortunately, Coda lost a leg this week. He likes to play in the background of the videos by himself. For this. Well, you can put it as a gift and they'll oh, put it wow. up. And he's even kind of the butt of the joke sometimes. <laughs> but at the end of the day, we still love this giant white fluff ball. Yes, I'm talking about you, buddy. So, Coda isn't really the traditional dog that a lot of people think of. Like, Cooper's kind of like the classic, always in your face, always wanting all of your attention, all of your love, wanting to love you with all their heart, wanting to play all the time and be the center of everything. Coda's not like that at all. Coda's three years old. He's still a very, very young dog, but he's extremely lazy. He likes to lay around and sleep all day. He doesn't really need too much of your attention. He's very, very independent. And honestly, his favorite thing in the world is to just defend the house. Like, he'll sit and watch out the front door. He'll pace the back windows back here, looking at the lake, barking at every boat that goes by. That's what his breed is. He was bred to herd sheep and protect them from the wolves. And that's just kind of what he does. His job is to protect this house. At least that's what he thinks it is. So uh, today, we're gonna make him happy. So part one of making Coda happy is probably a pretty obvious one. Both of our boys are very food motivated. Watch this. I bet you guys haven't seen him move that fast in quite a while. Toys. Cooper will love and play with any toy that you could possibly give him. No matter what shape, what size, what color, how you play with it, doesn't matter, he'll love it. Code, on the other hand, is a little bit more peculiar. His favorite thing to do is play by himself as long as there's a squeaker in it. His second favorite thing is tug of war. Now here's the deal. Coda plays tug of war in a really weird way. He doesn't like the tugging part. He will sit there all day and just hold it in his mouth. If you pull, he'll kind of try to pull back a little bit. But if you just sit still, he just likes to hold it in his mouth. Next up, about the only normal thing he shares with other dogs is he really likes belly rubs. He especially likes it if you cuddle him on the floor while doing so. <laughs> Similar to food, he also really loves his treats. Hey bud, do you want a cookie? Pound it. Good boy. Catching's not his strongest suit. And last, but definitely not least, I am 100% convinced that if Coda could spend the rest of his times doing a one thing and one thing only, it'd be a game of chase. That is no joke out in the Florida humidity. My gosh, I don't know how you do it, buddy. You have so much more hair than me, too. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching Super Cooper Sunday. I, uh, I know this one was a little bit shorter than normal, wasn't it, Coop? You guys typically like them long. <laughs> oh, I won't even say it. Anyway, um, but I enjoyed filming it. I hope you guys did, too. Let's see what you got, Coop. Can you 
you catch it from a distance, oh, look at that. So uh, we're gonna see you guys next Sunday. Today, originally I was kind of planning on doing a water day, but you guys might not be able to tell. It's one of those weird Florida days where it kind of looks sunny, but we've had like three or four rain clouds pass through. Some of them have lightning and thunder and stuff, so I'm just kind of chilling in the house, not gonna go out in the water today. Maybe we'll do something with the jet skis and kayaks and stuff next week, and uh, thanks again, guys. We'll catch you guys later. Hit that like button for our boy Coda here, the star of today's episode. Hit it twice for Koopy. Where are you going, bud? There you are. Thank you guys so much for watching. We're gonna catch you guys later. Peace out.